got 7 a.m. Maybe now it's 8, <laughs> probably. Today it should be good weather, except around 2 p.m. Uh, there is a thunderstorm forecast, so probably some downpours. So we want to escape that, but I'm not sure if we will be able to. We will see. But now it's probably 30 degrees already, I would say. <laughs> so, awesome. Packing the bikes and off we go. So my friends, we've got fifth day of our trip and right now we are going towards Dolomites. So you can see on the map we are going east and slightly south and we are on the main roads right now but soon we will be on the white ones which are the best. And to get there we've got probably like 60-80 miles and we really hope that when we get there it won't be raining. So we are on the road and now my friends you might guess when we will stop for the first time. Yeah. <laughs> well it didn't took too long, did it? <laughs> and now I will ask my friend the question. And why am I asking him that? You might know from previous episode. A czemu tam nie wchodzisz? Tam? <laughs> He said there is an evil there, but I couldn't show you that because my camera died. But hey, <laughs> we are on the bikes again and this time we hope that we'll do some miles. Until the next stop, of course. What can I tell you guys? We are not on holidays here. Someone needs to stop and shoot all those views for you, right? But with all seriousness, it was beautiful here. And look, look at that road. Yeah, we were just there a few minutes ago. Brilliant, right? Trust me, it really was smashing indeed. But hold on, hold on, and wait for that. Told you so. But okay, one more zoom. Look at that. <laughs> Crazy, isn't it? I think it is. By the way, that zoom in that camera is really impressive. Good for showing you something like that, right? Okay, enough of this, let's jump on the bikes and let's do some miles this time. But you know what? Actually the view on the left is even better. <laughs> I'm sorry. And by saying nice views, I didn't mean all the German ladies and all German bikers. But that old Harley with Evo lamp was quite interesting. So I took a short glance. Evo! Good one. <laughs> yeah, short conversation and off we go this time. And yes, no jokes this time, I mean it. We will be riding for some time. So let's take a look at the views from the bike. And now look at that weird road construction on the right. But specifically, here it's impressive. Well, that's quite Italian to be honest with you. I think you wouldn't spot something like that 
anywhere else in Europe. Well, maybe I'm wrong. Yes, we are entering the most famous part of Dolomites, which means time for a picture and stop. Of course it does. Yeah, but this time let's not waste too much time because it's better to ride. I mean, especially here. Just look around, it's absolutely magnificent. My head was spinning 360 degrees easily. But not only overtaking, but overtaking single-handed. That's something, isn't it? But jokes aside, it's time to get her! Onwards! Okay, it's time to admit that. I'm in love. That Ducati scrambler is absolutely fantastic. Ale widać, że ten motorek się prowadzi jak złoto. Okay, I'm obviously joking, but that's something, isn't it? Lovely looking girl on a motorcycle. Brilliant. And I was really interested in that bike, to be honest with you, because I think Ducati Scrambler is a perfect bike for this type of roads. For cornering, for fun in the bends, and she just proved that. At least to me. What you reckon, guys? But anyway, let's go back to the ride, shall we? Look guys, that's a stop number million and two. <laughs> we stopped again. Because why not?
But now we were laughing because we were overtaken by such a shitty car. And it won't be the last one, trust me on that. And also we were wondering about the cameras which are over the road here and there. And the guy didn't bother about them. Interesting. Yes, my friends, we are leaving Dolomites and Alps behind. Unfortunately, that's the end of that part. However, we can still admire gorgeous Italian views. Right? But in the meantime, we arrived at our destination for today. And we arrived much faster than we initially wanted. But there is a reason for that. And I will tell you exactly why. Lucas, we arrived at the place today. Uh, not me. Bed and breakfast. It's not bed and breakfast nor a hotel. Uh, the bikes are, well, this is a street. Mountains are there. Can you see? And there. And there are clouds because there is a risk of thunderstorms and rain. So we are rather early. I don't really know what time is it. Probably before six, even. Probably five. Oh, maybe even four. I don't know. I will check later on. However, thing is that yeah, it might rain, so we decided not to risk it. And we took the uh, bed and breakfast today, especially that yesterday for the camping we paid 45 euros. And for the place here we've paid 50 euros, so no brainer. And the bikes are actually here. See? So it's not visible. They are not visible from the street. But I'm going to use my U-lock. So, yeah, look, this is the weird place we've been. Doesn't matter, it's all right. It's Subaru, just in case. <laughs> and even in case of rain, we could put them here, maybe, potentially. Who knows? Who knows? So, my bike is secured. Ta -da! And my friend is there. <laughs> He's opening the beard, so I'm going up and... To się nagrywa teraz? Tak, Kameruje się? Kameruje się. Wiesz, że rozumiesz, musi być coś mocniejsze. Dobra, czekaj, chodź. I teraz musisz go tak. Tak. Very much. <laughs> Quite well. No to... Zdrowie na budowę. To z zdrówką. Oh. Yeah. Oh, the so. yeah. Extra. And for the unknown reason I switched to Polish language when recording. I really don't know why, but hey, probably it's because it was too hot. It was really seriously boiling hot. Uh, we've got aircon turned on to the max. And you can see here that the windows were closed, shades were closed. And yeah, it was still hot. And look, you've got two beds here. The bigger one is this, and the person on this one can call girls. <laughs> yeah, and we will be sleeping on the big one, and the girls will be sleeping here. <laughs> Jokes aside, look at that beautiful young man. <sighs> Jesus, I don't know why I'm switching languages. This is just stupid. Anyway, uh, we've got balcony here yeah. so we have to open those doors and then we will be able to to go away outside which will be brilliant or not bloody hell i'm red i'll show you something what so Whoa. 
Ma che non sta nessuno, non sta nessuno. Ma che? Ma prendi la chiave, di là che ti faccio vedere, vieni. So, the bikes were there, now they are here. And that's awesome. Because. Because in case of rain, yeah, they will be dry. But I will show you how it looks like here. And I was talking a lot about the rain, I know. But look at that cloud over that mountain. And here is another one. And do you know what? There was a forecast of absolutely massive thunderstorms and torrential rains in Dolomites. So we chickened and that's why we are so early here. And look, a sports camp there. Very good, very good. <laughs> And yeah, it looks like the weather is still okay and we could ride. But you know what? The temperatures were crazy and the air was so dense. And later on, we had a spectacle of clouds. Just look at that. The funniest part is that in our bed and breakfast, it was just raining for five minutes. But yeah, in the mountains, yeah, there were torrential rains. Just look at those clouds there. That's where the rain was. Anyway, that's it for today and see you in the next episode. Or maybe not, because it will be extremely boring and hot. And I will do stupid things. So, yeah, just kidding. See you next time. Give me thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and whatnot. Thanks a lot. Cheers.